Hey guys, so uh, just thought I'd do a quick update here. Uh, we got some new lights on 147. One of them, well, you probably see all three of them here, but uh, I just, I'll show this side off. This is the what the old, what it looked like before, what the old side looked like, what basically what it looked like before. It had these style of uh, Dialyte 70 series. And then you had some of these guys down here and you cannot see these at all in your mirrors so i wanted better lights and i got better lights have not started on the back yet so all this stuff is still the same but if you open this up see i got my brake lights back here and then i got my turn settings up front so uh reverse lights i'll have to tackle that another day i also need to put my new license plate on here while i'm thinking of it but over here what we got you can see I got red in the back and amber in the front lights are a little bit larger and I think it'll look better um, I should have taken better precautions with that one so I'm not gonna show it off I scratched the paint and stuff but uh because I got frustrated and tried to just get it done but got to take time to do things like this don't let it frustrate you when you when you start getting frustrated it's good to walk away but as you can see um the old lights were a little bit longer and i thought these screw holes would be about the same but they're just barely off so uh here's one of the amber lights i have to put on the other side and uh there's one of the old lights so as you can see well maybe maybe not Get this in my hand properly. Um, screw holes are just a little bit off. So I had to drill new holes. And that's what was causing my issue was broken screws I couldn't get out. And uh, yeah, I should have, I, I tried to get the old or the old one out and it just uh, wouldn't come out. No matter what I tried, so I tried drilling through it, and I just decided I'm going to, because it was just slightly off, and that's why it was catching so bad, and uh, should have just, I drilled a hole right beside it, and I put a smaller screw in, and it would work fine. That's what I should have done, but I uh, let it get to me, and I just kind of got frustrated with it, and damaged my bus further in the process. So, uh, other than that, I just finished the auction for that fe and the ce that i wanted to get for parts for this thing for tires and a fuel tank but it ended up not working out so uh oh well these things happen i didn't think it would but i, I had some optimism see maybe if it would but um here's the sound off turn signal same as what 23 has on the front except these are brand new so yeah it's gonna be fun um still gonna keep all my old lights i'm taking off of this i'm not selling any of them just because i like I, well, I may, i'll probably sell the ones off the back just because i don't really care for those we're just give them away because i don't know they're dirt cheap lights I, I couldn't really get much out of them so if somebody wants them i'll give them to them but uh yeah that's about it just a quick little update oh also uh i broke my gauge cluster see the crack in it because it want to work and that's the only way you can get it to work in this bus so i've got another gauge cluster i'm probably going to throw in here hopefully it works it's from noah's old carpenter so uh we'll get to that eventually but yeah that'll be it thanks for watching